Okay, the third, the third problem that I'm going to discuss or solve is this one. This is the, this is the moment diagram, and we are going to draw the shear or the load and the shear diagram. Okay. Let's draw some lines. Okay, so let's start. Let's draw again the moment diagram. Moment diagram. Nag upward siya. Nag, nag move siya upward by 80. So most likely, pag inuna niya ang moment, fix ni dere. Okay, 80. And then, Straight line to 108. So, 108.75. And then, concave downward second degree to zero. So, this is second degree. And then, first degree. Now, okay, so from here, we not draw the, we not draw the shear diagram, okay. <clears throat> this is the shear diagram. Now, from this point to this point, ang moment nag-increase from 80 to 108.75. And the increase... This one, the increase from 80 to 108, that's 28.75. No? This increase, 28.75, is equal to the area of the shear diagram. Now, since first degree ang moment, it means na horizontal line ang sa shear. And positive man, can anag increase man. From 80 to 108, so therefore, positive ang area there. This one. Okay. And since 5, ne, so makompute ito na, let us say y. So solving for y, ang area in the uh, shear diagram is equal to the change in moment. So 5 times y equals... 28.75. We can solve for y. 28.75 divided by 5. That's 5.75. Okay. This is 5.75. Now, <clears throat> okay. From 108.75 to 0, nag-drop siya. No? So, which means na, ang area there, eh, ang area sa shear diagram, negative. And since second degree, eh, triangle there. Eh. Okay. So, <clears throat> so, now, given the problem na, the reaction at the right end is 34.25. So, which means na if this is the beam, na I support the uh, Let's assume the roller. And a reaction na ni, given one, no? if the reaction at the right support is 34.25, 25. So, therefore, sa so shear diagram, na nakay 34 na under eh. Negative 34.25. Para, with the reaction 34, ma zero siya. So, karon, as sin second degree ni, eh, so straight line there eh. So, ang ano na to is there eh. Oh. We have this area. Yan eh. Hmm. Uh, Z. 
Pwede sa ito mo assume na basin or probably triangle siya. No? Okay. Now, if we compute the area of this, dapat equal siya. Ano, eh? 108.75 to 0 Roman. So, dapat ang area ano, niya, 108.75. I-check na to. One half times 5 times 34.25. 85 lang man. So, kulang ni. So, dapat na ato value di rin. Para ang area ni is 108.75. So, how do you solve for Z? Ano lang. Area of trapezoid. So, 1 half of Z plus 34.25 times this distance 5 equals this one 108.75 so ma solve na to ang z so using caltech 1 half chief sol valley plus 34.25 times 5 equals 108.75 it's 9.25 so, negative ni. Negative 9.25. Okay. That's it, no? Okay. So, after this, let us try to draw the low diagram. Now, from 0, nag-move siya upward of 575. So, most likely, thin support na. Ang reaction niya na is 5.75. And then, no load. Horizontal man. So, no load there eh. And then, nag-drop din siya. From 5.75, nag-drop siya to 9.25. Pila man na. 5.75 plus 9.25. 15. So, natay. Concentrated there eh na. 15 uh, kilo newtons. Okay. And then from here, from this point to this point, nag-drop siya. Horizontal line, which means na uniform load ang sa dere. So, nata uniform load dere. Oh. So, ang next ano is ang value na sa value sa omega. Again, ang area sa load diagram is equal to the change in shear. Ang change in shear na to, you can do it. Oh, that's 34.25 minus 9.25. So, can you change in shear na 25? Equal na sa area sa low diagram. So, 5 omega equals 25. So, omega equals 5. So, this is 5 kilonewtons per meter. Now, it's not yet finished. Remember na sa moment diagram, not a vertical line. So, it means na na moment sa beam and positive man um, positive na moment is pag external siya the beam smiles man so yun na siya ba okay um 80 kilonewton meter okay. the beam smiles man I check na to. Let's check this one if correct ba. So, checking. First one is summation of force of vertical equal to zero. Check na to pag if zero ba yun. So, 5.75 plus 34.25 Minus concentrated load na 15 minus resultant ane, 5 
times 5. Let's check kung 0 ba. No? So, 575 plus 34.25 minus 15 minus 5 times 5. Okay, 0. No? So, 0 equals 0. Satisfied. The next one is summation of moment equal to 0. Okay, let us sum up moment here. There, eh? Sige. Ang ET is clockwise, so that's negative. Negative ET, 15 is clockwise also, downward man. So it's negative 15. The, the distance of 15 is 5. And then resultant. The resultant of this load is 25. No? 5 times 5. And the distance is 7.5. One half of 5 is 2.5 plus 5, 7.5. So we have minus 25 times 7.5. And then moment of this reaction plus 34.5. Distance to the left support, it's 10. Uh, check na to. Let's check kung zero ba. So we have negative 80 minus 15 times 5. Negative 80 minus 15 times 5 minus 25 times 7.5. Plus 34.25 times 10. Zero. Zero equal to zero. So, which means na our solution is correct. From this moment diagram, this is the corresponding shear diagram and the corresponding load diagram. Okay. So, solving this type of problems will really test your knowledge about shear and moment in beams. Okay? Thank you for watching.